Hello and welcome to another Blender tutorial to do with um, Daisy and breaking guns down. My name's Fizzy. Um, currently partnering with uh, with Flanker.com. You guys have seen the stuff that he's been releasing. It's absolutely incredible. Uh, it's changed the scene without a doubt. Anyway, I'm just going to show you this new tool that we're we're working on. That is soon going to be available for everyone. And if it is already available, then here's how you use it. So we're going to start off by using all of his tools. So we're going to import first a, uh, a weapon. So let's do, uh, hang on. I'm just going to be choosing the gun now. So we're going to go for this one. We're probably going to do an SRS. I can show you how this actually works properly. So we'll choose SRS. And that will import now. Cool. Excellent. So then we'll click here. Click here and we'll use Daisy Import Cleanup, which will then put it into multiple sections for us. Now we know this one's color one, so we're going to call it color one. We know this one's color two, so we're going to call it color two. We know this one's color three, and the other one, of course, color four. Now, with this new tool, uh, a lot of people find it a pain in the ass going here, going like this, going like this, hitting here, choosing faces hitting L and selecting these bits and hitting P to separate what they want to do, right? Well, we've come up with a solution. So basically, you can click this, and if you come to here and you scroll down to here, you'll see a new little tab here called flanker.com model separation tool version one. So when we go down to here, you'll see it says add an object. We hit add an object, and it'll give us the option to add an object. Now we can see we've got color one selected. So we're going to grab color one. We're going to drop it down to here. And all you've got to do is hit separate. And as you can see, it's been completely separated. No more zooming in to get these tiny little bits. It's all been done for you. Even down to this, which I think is kind of cool. You can even color code them if you really want to sit and do that. But if you don't like this type of stuff with um, it being separated like this, then there is an option to just hit one, get a side view on it. Highlight them all, Control J, and it's all now one big object again. And that's just an option for that. But this is a complete new way of separation with um with Daisy. I think it's incredible. Um, another thing you can do as well, if we go back, I will show you. Uh, what we can do is, once we're back here, if we add another object down here, we can then add color two. We add another object, we can then add color three. And we add a final object, which is color four, and we hit separate, and you named it all separated. The entire gun, every selection under every cat category. You see, there's so many of these. That is literally down to the point of where you go to a bolt and you look inside of a bolt and it selects these. So some people might want to color code these. I don't know why, because it's really like small detail, but. Hell, as I said, you can just go like that to really put them back together if you want to. Control J, and it's back as one. So yeah, this is um this is the new tool, and uh, this is gonna change the face of Daisy, especially when it comes to skinning guns. So you can do some crazy stuff with this, and uh, we look forward to seeing what you guys are gonna make. So yeah, I'm Fizzy, and uh, on behalf of Flanker.com, have a good day, guys. Bye bye.